Good morning, Longhorns. I'm Rio. And I'm Trevor. And I hope you guys are all enjoying the beautiful sunshine today. Tomorrow we'll be having a blood drive bus on campus. Hopefully you've already signed up. Thanks for helping and we'll see you tomorrow. Here's the news for today. Are you wondering what new and exciting things are happening in our school district? Please join us tomorrow night at 6.30 in the PAC to hear from our own superintendent, Dr. Devin Badishka. Attention all students, tomorrow is our annual talent show, The Ranch Review. It's in the PAC and tickets are $8 for the 3.30 show and $10 for the 7 p.m. show. The tickets will be sold in the ASB room at Lunch and Nutrition. Join the fight to cure cystic fibrosis. The RBB fund run to fight cystic fibrosis is this Saturday at 8.30 a.m. at the football field. There will be t-shirts and prizes, including a pizza party for the highest fundraisers. Registration is only $2 in the finance office. Help fundraise on behalf of Mrs. Hawkins' son, Ben, and thousands of others who fight this disease every day. All AP students, AP exam registration is being conducted from January 31st to February 22nd. For the first time ever, registration and payment for your exams will be done all online. To speed up the process, if you qualify for federal free or reduced lunch, please fill out the reduced lunch verification form outside Ms. Newman's office. And that's all we have for today, Longhorns. Here's Gabe with some club news. <laughs> Thanks, Trevor and Rio. The Black Student Union will be going to Miracles College for their annual United Black Student Conference, March 3rd. This field trip is open to all students. It is first come, first serve. Please come to the BSU meeting on Wednesday in room 222 to pick up a permission slip. Black Student Union is open to all students and faculty on the RBB campus. Join the Artistic Rhapsody Club to meet other creative and art-oriented students. Meetings are held on the second and fourth Wednesday at their school from 2.30 to 3 in Mrs. Strasser's room, 2.25. And here's Ellie and Cameron with a quick sports update. Hey Longhorns, I'm Cameron. I'm Ellie. And this is RBB Sports. <laughs> Send me your location, let's focus on communicating Cause I just need the time and place to come through Today, girls soccer has a game against EC at 5.30 Friday, boys play against Vista High School at 5.30 It's a home game, so make sure you're there to support Boys wrestling has a duel meet against San Marcos tomorrow at 7 It's senior night, come and support Girls water polo has a game today against Fallbrook Friday they have a game against Oceanside and they're both at the wave. <laughs> I got it, I got it. I just needed like. <clears throat> Today boys basketball has an away game against EC at 7 o'clock. Friday they play against Vista High School at 7 o'clock too. Don't forget about the girls game. It's at 5.30. It's a maroon out. <laughs> I'm Ellie and I'm here with our first person we're interviewing on the basketball team. This is Austin. Hello, I'm Austin Lucas. I'm number 10. I'm a senior and I play point guard. Hi, I'm Trevor Sinceri. I'm a senior. I'm number 24 and I play forward on the varsity basketball team. I'm Chris MacGyver. I'm a senior and I'm number 15 on varsity basketball and I'm a small forward slash power forward. This is Trey Wilcher. I'm a senior. My number is 23 and I'm a forward. I'm Tobin Schwartz. Uh, I'm number two. I'm a senior and I'm a shooting guard. I'm Stephen Vivier. I'm number 11. I'm a senior and I play every position. Ooh. See from the team this season. Um, I expect us to go, um, go out and play hard each and every game. Practice like it's our last. Because for me, it's my last year. I just want to go out oh, as a winner. I just want everyone to work hard and do what they can to pan out our season. Uh, so I think we need to really establish our legacy as like the beginning of the rebirth of our program and we need to like start to put the program back on its feet and really get it kick started. Who do you guys think is the most standout player on the team? Oh, I'd have to say Tobin Schwartz. I'd have to say Tobin Schwartz. He's been stepping up in the deep shots lately. 
I'd say Chris MacGyver. It's open shorts, man. He's so he's so wet, man. He's so wet. <laughs> Probably my dad, Steven. Ah, uh, no one's impressed me. <laughs> nah. Who do you think is the toughest opponent or opponents? Uh, I'd have to say this year, Vista's program and Mission Hills program. Probably Vista and Mission Hills. Mission Hills and Vista. Our last question, what do you think about the coach this year? Um, I think he's a great guy. He's really pushing the program in the right direction. And we all know that he knows basketball. He's played his whole life. And we think he really knows what he's doing out there. And he's doing a great job. Oh, I love Coach Aarons. He's a good guy. He's, he understands his players. He, he does a lot to help the program. And I'm just super excited to see what he does for the future of Rancho.